Hello, and welcome back to Europe in Detail. This time, we're packing our bags for a country overflowing with grand legends, lively traditions, and jaw-dropping views, Lithuania. This isn't your average trip around Vilnius or a stroll along the beautiful Curonian Spit. Oh no, we're diving deep into Lithuania's soul, exploring the vibrant history, exhilarating present, and the lively spirit of its amazing people. We're set to uncover an astonishing 39 fascinating facts about this country. So, let's dive right in. Number 1. Let's start off with a fun fact. Lithuania is home to the very middle of Europe. Yes, you heard that right. There is even a stone near Vilnius that marks this special spot. Don't miss it when you visit. Number 2. The vibrant capital city of Vilnius was named after the Vilnia River. The river's name itself is believed to be derived from the Lithuanian word Vilnius, meaning a surge or wave. Number 3. Lithuania is the land of storks, the country's national bird. With over 13,000 stork couples calling it home, Lithuania has one of the highest densities of these birds in the world. Number 4. When you think of Lithuania, think amber. The Baltic country is often referred to as the amber land, owing to the ample deposits of amber found on its coastline. If you're lucky, you might even discover a piece washed ashore. Number 5. The Lithuanian fear of the evil eye is also a deeply rooted superstition. To ward off the evil eye, locals often wear jewelry adorned with amber, believing its natural power protects against misfortune. Number 6. Lithuanian, one of the oldest languages in Europe, is truly cherished by its people. It has kept a lot of the grammar and sounds from Proto-Indo-European, which is like the grandparent of most European languages. Number 7. In Lithuania, a child's name isn't just chosen for its sound. Often, names hold a deeper meaning, reflecting desirable characteristics. For example, the popular name Vitatis means chase away the enemy. Number 8. Say hello to Neringa, a calm place on the Curonian spit, where life is all about taking it easy. It's the perfect getaway for anyone wanting a break from the city's hustle and bustle. Number 9. The secret to Neringa's chill vibe isn't just one thing, it's a mix. Eating local fish is a big part of it. Being surrounded by beautiful nature makes it easy to stay active. Who needs a gym? But the best part is probably the laid-back lifestyle. Instead of rushing around like in the city, people here take leisurely walks, chat over a glass of traditional meatus, and live life without the stress. Here, time is truly on their side. Number 10. As per the most recent United Nations estimates, Lithuania has a population of about 2.73 million people. Of these, the bustling city of Vilnius alone houses 541,000. That's a substantial portion of the total Lithuanian population residing in just one city. Number 11. Vilnius, whose history stretches back to the 14th century at least, has one of the biggest medieval old towns in Europe. It's a UNESCO World Heritage Site, brimming with Gothic, Renaissance, Baroque, and neoclassical buildings. Number 12. For our next fact, let's dive into how Lithuania is run. Lithuania works as a semi-presidential republic, with the people voting directly for their president. Here's something cool. In some elections, voting is not just encouraged, it's required. This shows just how much they value everyone taking part in democracy. Number 13. Lithuania's weather can be quite the adventure. It's possible to witness all four seasons within a single day. However, don't be put off. Despite its unpredictable climate, Lithuania offers stunning landscapes that more than make up for any weather surprises. Number 14. Founded in the 16th century, Vilnius University stands as one of the oldest and most respected educational institutions in Eastern and Central Europe. It showcases Lithuania's deep dedication to education and the pursuit of knowledge. Number 15. The Lithuanian flag is more than just a flag. Its yellow stripe represents the sun and prosperity. The green symbolizes the country's lush landscapes, and the red stands for the courage and spirit of the Lithuanian people. Number 16. Lithuanians love to toast with their national drink, Midas. This honey-based alcoholic beverage dates back to ancient times and is a must-try for any visitor to Lithuania. Number 17. Lithuanian traditional dishes aren't just meals, they're experiences. Take sepalinai, for instance. These potato dumplings stuffed with meat, cheese, or mushrooms, named after their resemblance to Zeppelin airships, are a hearty culinary delight 
that's often shared among family and friends. Number 18. Easter in Lithuania is celebrated with a unique tradition, egg rolling. It's believed that the further the egg rolls, the longer the thrower's life will be. If your egg cracks on others, expect good luck. Number 19. Did you know that Lithuanian men are typically among the tallest in the world? Yes, Lithuania often tops the charts in terms of average male height, standing tall and proud. Number 20. In Lithuania, the longest day of the summer isn't just a day. It's a nationwide festival called Joninies or Rasos. Bonfires are lit, flower wreaths are made, and folk songs echo throughout the land. It's a magical tradition that binds the country in a shared heritage. Number 21. On January 1, 2015, Lithuania said goodbye to the Litas and warmly embraced the Euro, becoming the final of the three Baltic states to join the Eurozone. Number 22. As an active player in international politics, Lithuania joined the European Union and NATO in 2004, contributing to global security and cooperation. Number 23. Lithuania boasts a beautiful coastline that stretches over 56 miles along the Baltic Sea. Its crowning jewel is the Curonian Spit, a stunning UNESCO World Heritage Site home to Europe's highest moving sand dunes. Number 24. Lithuania was the first country to break away from Soviet rule in 1990, marking the beginning of the end of the USSR. Today, Lithuania's Independence Day on March 11th is a nationwide celebration of freedom and resilience. Number 25. Basketball is the country's most beloved sport. It's not just a pastime, but a national passion. So much so that Lithuanians often refer to basketball as their second religion. Number 26. Officially called the Republic of Lithuania, the country's name is believed to originate from the Lithuanian word Litava, which means rainy. Although with its sunny dispositions and radiant culture, Lithuania could just as easily be the land of light. Number 27. The traditional Lithuanian turgas, or marketplace, is where all the action happens. People love to bargain here for fresh food, handmade items, and even old treasures. It's a fun part of daily life in Lithuania. Number 28. Lithuania had its heroes called Nignensai, or book smugglers. They were brave people who took risks to keep Lithuanian language and culture alive when it was banned between 1864 and 1904 by the Russian Empire. They would sneak books in Lithuanian printed using the Latin alphabet into the country, breaking the strict laws that said all books had to be printed in the Cyrillic script. Number 29. Near the city of Siolii, you'll find the Hill of Crosses. This place shows how strong and brave the Lithuanian people are. Even when others tried to destroy it, today it has more than 100,000 crosses each one telling a story of Lithuanian bravery and faith. Number 30. Nearly everyone in Lithuania knows how to read and write. The literacy rate is a super high 99.8%. The people of Lithuania really value learning. This love for education is seen in their rich history of learning, and they still put education first in their society today. Number 31. The emblem of Lithuania shows a knight on a horse, sword, and shield in hand. This image is a powerful symbol of the Lithuanian spirit. It speaks of bravery, grit, and a readiness to defend freedom and fairness. Number 32. Lithuania may not be a large country, but it's a heavyweight in the world of tech. With some of the quickest internet speeds globally, it earned itself the nickname Baltic Silicon Valley. Number 33. Trakai Island Castle in Lithuania is a must-see spot that takes you straight back to the medieval times. Located on an island in Lake Galve, it's the only castle in Eastern Europe completely on an island. A trip here is like stepping into a time machine. Number 34. The traditional music of Lithuania, called Sutartines, has a special multi-layered sound. It's so special that UNESCO has named it a part of the world's cultural heritage. Traditional instruments, like the kankles, a zither-like instrument, gives this beautiful music its unique charm. Number 35. Lithuania has a remarkably diverse flora and fauna, with over 48% of its land covered by forests. The country is home to many endangered species, such as the European bison, the Eurasian lynx, and the European mink. Number 36. Lithuania's traditional arts and crafts, like wood carving, weaving, and black pottery, 
tell a story of the country's rich cultural past and the artistry passed down through the ages. Number 37. Lithuanians have a unique tradition to remember their departed loved ones. On All Saints Day, or Velinis, cemeteries glow with the soft light of thousands of candles, creating a sight of calm beauty. Number 38. Oxtatesia National Park, created in 1974, is one of Lithuania's pioneering national parks. It shelters diverse wildlife, over 100 lakes, and some of Lithuania's most breathtaking natural scenes. Number 39. And last but not least, craving a real taste of Lithuania? Don't miss their much-loved dark rye bread. It's the star of every meal. They even craft a unique drink, kvass, from this fermented favorite. When in Lithuania, bread is a must-try treat. And that's a wrap. We've journeyed through 39 unique facts that paint a vivid picture of Lithuania, its vibrant culture, and its unique charm. If you love this video, don't forget to hit that like button. We'd love to hear your thoughts and experiences with Lithuania, so feel free to share them in the comments section below. Remember to hit that subscribe button to stay tuned to more thrilling expeditions on Europe in Detail. Thanks for watching. Until next time, keep exploring and stay curious.